find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Beat that entertainment. That entertainment. Why we have tape over our um, our, our uh, beverages. beverages. Yeah. Uh, it's because uh, we're actually not getting paid for promotion from anything. Uh, we're actually living off our girlfriends. Uh, we're both <laughs> stay-at-home dads. Fiance. Yeah. Well, he She'll got be to, mad if I let her be called a girlfriend. Yeah, he got to fiance. But I don't. My girlfriend's actually just a slut. So, uh, I'm joking, babe. I love you a lot. Uh, anyways, um, yeah, so yeah, so we're not getting paid for nothing. So, let me interject here real quick. What's up? Because I think instead of talking to them, mm-hmm. we just need to talk to each other. We're talking to each other. I know we are. But no, I'm, I'm just letting people know, wondering oh, why we're drinking beer with fucking tape on it. Yeah, no, I get that. But what I'm saying... Tape on it. I'm saying... Like the bottle broke and we just taped it back together. What's your input about that, Wayne? It's bullshit, right? He's stupid. No, I'm just I, yeah, all this shit can be edited out or it can be left in. I don't. It's think. getting left in, bro. Um, yeah, I was. I'm guys. We're still trying to figure out exactly how to fucking do this. Obviously, it's the first time we ever done this. is actually a fucking uh, a, a test. Yeah, you know what I mean, this is a practice run. Yeah, this is a pre episode. So yeah, we're just. So you might about never see this. You might never see it. But you might see it. Might maybe. What I would like from this. You cannot drop some words if we don't put this out. No. <laughs> what I would like because I was about to drop some shit. You hear me? Well, what I think we should do with this yeah. is like take a bunch of little cuts and make it into. A I don't think we should. I wish you'd quit talking like that. Actually, I'm telling that's what you, I bro, but idea. I just don't want to have to beat the fuck out of you because then we'll post that. You see that video uh, of little Cabby or whatever? Yeah, little, uh, little what's his name? Little Cabby, little uh, little white boy, and uh, that little black guy and the little white boy. You didn't see that? They was doing. Uh, a podcast on Adam Twenty Two, and he said, "He said I think he got some braces or something. He talks real funny. Like, I'm not gonna say no names, Justin Ohms. But anyways, he said, uh, talk funny? he said you a bitch. <laughs> he said you a bitch. And that little skinny black dude got up and just started throwing little baby punches at him. Yeah, it was terrible. It was a terrible fight. They, uh, neither one of them can fight. I'd fuck them both. Up. Oh. Ass, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, right. no. I could hold either. I could hold them down at the same time, hands on the back of their heads, and take turns going in and out of them." <laughs> what I could, that's what I could do to them little ass boys. All, All right, right, so yeah, uh, I don't know who they are, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't have any fear of you putting your hands on me. So, <laughs> yeah. uh, hey, you know, uh, actually, so we'll go ahead and get this out the way. How we met was I was a little kid. You remember that? And I put my hands on him. I, how old was I? Listen, Eight years old. Wait, wait, because you got to tell the story, all right? That's the story. No, I put my. I, I had just spent the night in jail. I walked from the jail. You should have been doing push-ups. When I went to jail, I was in there fucking I was shadow boxing doing night. setups. I, overnight. I spent overnight in jail. I only did overnight, too, bro. I'm a pussy. What do you mean? I called bro, my fucking brother crying. Come bond me out. You don't tell people the story. When you tell That's people That's the story. You shit. walked by and whooped your ass. No, I just spent a night in jail, slept on a fucking mattress made of bricks. You were sore. And I was fucking... It was fucking 6 o'clock in the morning or something. Mm-hmm. And for some reason, the annoying kid in Wayne Hills, which was you... Was fucking. Oh, I was the annoying kid when it was. Walk just happened to be walk. I was like, God. I can name ten Ricky. kids as more annoying before, than me. It's back before I liked him, right? So, I'm walking, and you just walk up and fucking bear. First of all, you were how old? Like eight. <laughs> that's, that's <laughs> Probably like eight. right, yeah. but you was the same size. You was bigger than me. Yeah, but my parents locked me out. I had nothing. I was okay. Out there bored. It was four o'clock in the morning. Me. You walk up. I'm bored, and, and I'm like, oh, fuck. Here he is. Shout there. out Bobby and Pudge for locking me out all the time. They just did that so I wouldn't eat. And <laughs> I used to be skinny. Then whenever I got older, my girlfriend had money. I said, fuck it, I'm eating. I started eating everything. And that's the fact. I eat everything now. From so ass from me. ass to cantaloupes, baby. You bear hugged me. Yeah, and I whooped your ass. And you fucking, no, you, you didn't throw no punches. You laid me. You laid, I picked you, you up. You No, you didn't pick me up. Okay. You bear hugged me, and you fell over on the green box. And I fell on the green box like, I picked Ricky, you up. I just I, got out of jail, bro. Let me go. No, I slammed him, bro. Slammed, slammed him. him. If you want to be honest, we was I kind of like box. Kane off wrestling. You know what I'm talking about? Choke slammed him. Hey, and you know, Cuz got up and ran. He got up and ran. <laughs> Did you I not? Lived, I lived right there. And you ran the whole we way. Was right, we was right He ran like one of them Naruto characters, you know, talking about head down, <laughs> hand, hands that. behind their back, running. That's how he ran. All right. But, uh. So, yeah, that's that's not how we met because I I knew you before that. You was mm-hmm. the annoying little fucking But that's kid how. That ran around talking Yeah, shit. but then a couple years later, you started molesting me. So, I think that's what really got. I think that's what got you. I got you, you back. Bro. Yeah, <laughs> got, that green box incident. Yeah, you got me back. Got you back. Got so, me you back. know what? Hey, no, really though. So we're hey, gonna Ricky, tell you. Try this four loco. That's what we're gonna do on oh, yeah, today. Fuck four loco. Yeah, fuck four us. loco. Unless you pay us. Unless we'll, you pay then us. We'll, then I'll tell the real story about Ricky and four locos and the shit that happened. 
Yeah. Four eleven. But we're going to tell the story about how we actually become really good friends. Like now he's like my brother. I love him to death. Yeah, I don't consider you a friend. Yeah, I don't consider him a friend either. When people talk family. about him, like that's my brother. Consider you family for yeah. sure. He's black, but it's still my brother. Yeah, it's kind of. He weird. never had a dad, so I was like, "Dad, I had a you, fucking dad." Bro. <laughs> yeah, his dad was white. I'll give him that. He had a dad, uh, <laughs> but uh, so yeah, so all right. <laughs> yeah, how we become friends? Blah blah. I actually, um, I was on house arrest, or I just got out of ju- uh, juvie. Mm. I was in Lawrence County. Wasn't I in were it? Still in. Yeah, and, and I liked me. I liked his music. This was back in the day. Back I liked his music and. I was like, yeah, bro, blah, blah. I was up there in Lawrence County. Yeah, me and crew when I get out, it down. When I get out, let, LC. Me, let me try rapping. Yeah, I tried rapping with him, bro, and I sucked. And Bad. Yeah, but I wasn't black. I didn't have the gift of God. You know what I mean? I was going to be out here being a working man. But you got, you got a little man. better over the years. Yeah. You know what I mean? Got a little better. By the way, you I'm not racist. Record. We say racist things to each other. I mean, I could be racist, but I don't know yet. Maybe give it 10 years and I go bald. He's I might racist. be racist. He's racist. Yeah, but anyways, though, seriously, so what happened was uh, we uh, – we started hanging out uh, after I got uh, home from Lawrence County and fucking got put on uh, house arrest and we started making music and then that's really what, I mean, that's what happened. And we then, spent every fucking day together. Every single day. For every fucking like day. like five years. I had just got into a new relationship and Kelly was super fucking chill about she it. She did yeah. I think now she probably thinks like, what the fuck was I thinking by letting, by dating this dude. First of all, I already had three baby mamas and like 10 kids. 10 kids. A and lot of kids. she was like, why am I? Or she, I don't think she thought about it back then. I think she was just like, you know what? He's cute and he does freaky stuff in the bedroom. Mm. But then I think now she's thinking back like, why the fuck did I let myself be with this dude who had three baby mamas and 10 kids and literally spent every fucking day after work for five years of our relationship with the in little, the basement with you? A little, with a little badass white boy from Wayne Hills. Yeah, she probably, <coughs> probably could have went and found somebody way better than me. Yeah, well, um, she didn't. So, but shout also, out to Kelly. Yeah, yeah, shout out to Kells. I, I, I fuck with Kells. Now, back then, I hated the whore. I was like, fuck <laughs> you, bitch. You mean, I, nah, I hated Kelly back then. I feel like she was trying to steal my best friend from me. I cried a lot. But anyways, no, what I was trying to say <laughs> was this dude used to molest me, right? So oh, yeah, I would stay at his house. He would come pick me up. I would stay at his house with him, okay? First of all, he's 10 years older than me. I'm uh, 26. He's gonna be 36 this year. No, he's gonna be 35. How much? How much you think I weighed back then? It don't matter. About 160. It don't pounds. matter. I was a little ass boy. I used to sleep in bed with him. Right, sleep in his bed. He'd get me drunk. First of all, I was a 15, 16 year old boy. He'd get me drunk. We would sleep in bed together. It was the freakiest shit ever. Ever. Now that I look back on it, because could you imagine me being 26 with a little 16 year old in my bed? Oh my, I'm going down smoking. And the craziest thing is about it, my parents were okay with it. My parents didn't give a fuck. That they I didn't was, even know where you was. They yeah. knew you was with me. They, they just they just knew you worked the house. Bobby they was like, nodded like, out. Yeah, it was like, as long as he ain't here, I don't care what's going on. Yeah, shout out to Bobby. But I, mean, I took care of you though. Yeah, he did. I didn't, and cigarettes, I didn't, and food, I didn't actually fuck you. Beer. Yeah, no, he, there was no penetration happening. <laughs> you no. gotta say nothing gay happened. Though. You did I mean, kiss me. You no, did you kiss me, me on Chris on Chris's porch that one time. You did kiss you me. Kiss me. Wayne, did he not admit to it a thousand times? There's a video of y'all kissing in your old basement. Oh, yeah, he's gay, bro. He's gay as fuck. And don't what? make it sound like we was kissing. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. You said that was all fucked yeah. up. Like, don't say it like we you was. You said it like it was real. Yeah, like we was like. Was. We wasn't making out or nothing, okay. right? Okay, okay, then then who kissed who, Kyle? Yeah, be honest. You know, technically, you kissed Ricky. You're Tec- a liar, yeah. bro. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like the story now. You're a liar. Yeah. No, I, it's. I would never I, kiss, I would never kiss a dude. Bro, you've been on the spectrum. I've even told you this a million <laughs> the times. Spectrum. You're talking about and I'm autistic. not talking about autistic. Oh, yeah, I'm not talking, about I'm talking about gay. gay. I'm talking about gay. I'm in the rainbow a little bit. My like God. I might be like. I the, see rainbows green, and I and I picture you at the at the end of one just fucking jogging in place. That's what I picture. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I, when I picture a rainbow, that's why I picture him just at the bottom of it, just jogging in place, happy as fuck. That was actually really funny. Yeah. We'll leave that in. Uh, we're leaving all this in, bro. This is all mm. going on. YouTube, shout out YouTube. I think the beginning started out too slow. Like now we're having fun. Yeah, but, but you got to think we're we're easing our way into it. You know what I mean this is yeah, our man. first fucking thing. We don't even know what to talk about. We're talking about you molesting me, dog. Which never happened. <laughs> yeah, never actually. Peta or whoever. Peta's like <laughs> Peta's like what animal cruelty or something? Yeah. Same Peta, shit. You Same Peta. shit. This motherfucker's an animal. Okay. Yeah. Same shit. So anyway. But yeah, so uh, that's that's how our friendship really started. We grew like a really close bond. We actually got signed uh, for EP deal whenever we was rapping to uh, Stephen Cooper. We was on the same label as Afro Man. I don't know if a lot of y'all know him. Uh, he's a white rapper from fucking West Virginia or something. Afro Man? Yeah. Is he not? 
I'm just joking. <laughs> yeah, I was just talking <laughs> shit. But no, uh, we got we was on the same label as Afro Man, Stephen Cooper. Shout out from Kansas City. <clears throat> that was when it was unlabeled. Yeah, unlabeled records. Now it's and now it's bigger entertainment. Yeah, and Stephen Cooper's done amazing for yeah, himself. Yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. Shout out. Him. He was on Orange Is the New Black. Little mm-hmm. little scene as a cop. His music, his music plays on fucking uh, Catfish, ESPN all the time. He got songs with Akon. I'm pretty sure DMX saw them. Stephen yeah, Cooper. Is, I fuck with Stephen Cooper. Stephen Cooper's hard. Shout out to Stephen Cooper for giving us a chance, even though we fucked it up. <laughs> we Shout out fuck to it you. Up. Yeah, we fucked it up, dude. We could Horseman actually still support. I still, I still have people like whatever happened to y'all's record deal. And it's mm-hmm. like, bro, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> like, just leave me alone. Don't message me no more. Blocked. Mm-hmm. Matter of fact, blocked. And it was like I, they just was concerned, but I was like, nah, I don't want to talk about that shit. Yeah, we. Uh, yeah, I fucked it up, but it is what it is. Uh, I used to be a really good rapper. Yeah, he, he, he used to be pretty alright. And a pretty decent raper. And a raper. He was, he was a raper. <laughs> Didn't your kid write that or something? <laughs> my, so my, oh, I think it was my oldest daughter. Uh, she had like a school thing. Yeah. And they was like, what do you want to be when you grow up? And she was like, I want to be a raper like my dad. But she <laughs> meant, she meant rapper. <laughs> she meant rapper. She just spelled it R-A-P-E-R. People don't know how to spell. Raper is spelled R-A-P-E-R. Rapper is spelled R-A-P-P-E-R. Yeah. My kid was like fucking, I don't know, five or something and didn't know so she wrote, "I want to be a yeah." His daughter's not like all, yeah. His, da- his daughter's not an Aussie or nothing. So you gotta stop talking <coughs> to people, bro. No, you said what? Listen, bro. If you oh, want, bro, you know on on a, on comments, bro, it's be like, man, fat guy, blah blah, all that shit. You know how you do fat wanna, people. I'm more discriminated against than blacks. You I'm know what I mean? This shit. Uh, what, what's it called? My PR or whatever. Public relations. Oh, I'm, yeah. I love everybody. Yeah, I don't care what you do. Me too. I love everybody. I love mm-hmm. prostitutes the most. I believe, yeah. Yeah. Your old lady's a fucking prostitute. Give her 10 well, bucks. She, she fucking gobble you money. down. She only charges 10 bucks for a gobble. <laughs> but anyways, though, yeah, so... Uh, I, bro, wait till I start telling stories about Natasha on here. I've known her for... I've known Natasha since... You want to name drop, we, though? That we're doing? We, we've already talked about Kelly. Kelly Joe? Is that what we're doing? We, name we, dropping? We've already talked about Kelly. I already told us. Yeah, but you ain't going to say my old lady's name. I wanted people to think that I was shout single. Shout out Kelly. I wanted people to think I was single. I wanted to give off the single vibes. And you just... I mean, you're... You just did that. You can be single though. Yeah, I'll leave it right now. Fuck her. It's like, what is she doing? She's at home watching my kids. You can be single real quick if somebody wants. You know what I mean? If like, who you want? You Mm -hmm. want like a? You want like a? Angelina Jolie. I'll take her old ass. Yeah. Angelina Jolie. I'll take your old ass. I figured that's what. I'll beat the fuck out of Billy Bob Thornton, and that's a fact. Are they together? They used to be. I don't know about. I don't keep up with her no more. (laughs) Are they not together no more? Look it up. I remember Look seeing it up real quick. on the red carpet, and they was wearing each other's blood around each other's necks in a little vial. Oh, uh, no, that's MGK and Megan Fox. They do that little freaking well, shit. Uh, Billy Bob and Angelina started that, and then Megan Fox and MGK was like, yo. Bro, did you, uh, that. you know he cheated on cheated on her or whatever? I, that's yeah. what I read anyways. I don't, you know I mean? I don't know if it's true. Oh, you about to have MGK mad. Yeah, MGK, hey, I've met because, and me and Wayne, y'all can't see him, but he's uh, behind over there, this little section. You got a video. If you could somehow put the video of you bear hugging MGK and picking his fucking yeah. six foot six ass. That's what up. I did to you. Yeah, I met MGK <laughs> and uh, we went to his house as well. Beat, well, Wayne beat on his door. Are they not together? No, not since 2003. Oh, fuck. I wasn't even born in 2003. She was to Brad Pitt from 2014 to 2019. Oh, well, fuck Brad That's Pitt. That's who she too. adopted all them little black babies with. Uh-huh. Oh, and I was like, you know what? That's nice of y'all, but that's weird. I I hate that white couples with black kids. How's that happen? I feel like they don't know how to raise black yeah. people the way they should be. But they yeah. was they wasn't black. Cause you know, Angelina wasn't... Jolie and Brad Pitt ain't stealing nothing. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> you know that they're not stealing nothing, bro. I mean, don't come on. No, bro. They wasn't adopted African Americans. They was adopting Africans. Like Africans are different than black people in America. Oh, so they they don't steal. I'm not saying motherfucking black people in America. That's still. how that was a little more racist than what I was saying. I was saying they they don't they're not in America. They don't understand how America works. Oh, I don't think so. Anyway, I might be wrong. Africans, so you know, I don't even think people in Africa are actually broke. No, they're not. Africa's fucking. Beautiful. Yeah, I think Africa might have more shit than we do here. Like, Literally, bro. I think they got flying cars already. And uh, really, some I really, parts of Wakanda type shit. Yeah, I don't know. Who Wakanda, <laughs> I don't know what a Wakanda is. Is that candy I mean, or watch, something? What? You don't watch Wakanda? What? Wakanda? Is that the guy that with the candy shop or whatever? What? <laughs> Willy Wonka? <Walker. laughs> yeah. Is that not it? What is it? What is Come it? on, bro. You ain't see that Marvel movie. What? Are you talking about like superheroes? Yeah, it's black I don't black watch. Black. I don't watch it. Like you know, I, you know, I don't watch it. What like do you that. watch? Uh, I just literally. You watch? Do uh, you prefer movies or shows? Uh, I watch uh, literally just documentaries or like 
stuff about killing. I like I'm real big and I like watching people die. Other, other than that though, do you uh, watch? Do you prefer like a fighting? series? Nah, or, or? I watch. I watch. Yeah, I watch like TV series. I mean, I fuck with documentaries. Like yeah, like uh, like Dexter. Shout out Dexter. Will promote that without getting paid. I fucking. I saw they was about to come out with a. I another, couldn't get it, bro. I love. You I, couldn't I, get into I've, Dexter. I've you I've fuck watched, with Dexter. I know you do. What? I probably watched Dexter three times with Kelly, and I couldn't. Bro, tell Dexter you. is hard, bro. I've rewatched it six times. No specifics about it. It's six times. Supernatural. Dean. I'll be the third Winchester, baby. Fuck watched, Adam. I've never watched that. Uh, no, real. Oh, Supernatural. I don't, I don't like show. series though. I just yeah. like to watch a movie and it's over and I'm done. I ain't got to fucking and worry Wonka, about it next week. Wonka's a movie. Willy Wonka. Well, what oh, you, Wakanda. It's a fucking Wakanda? Marvel movie. It's like yeah. I, Iron Man and all them motherfuckers. Yeah, I don't movie. watch it like that. I wasn't uh, a fucking. I don't know if I can say this on camera, but a faggot growing up. You cannot say that <laughs> shit. Bro, you gotta cut that. Yeah. Cut <laughs> That's that. not getting cut. If, bro, you, if you yeah. say faggot, bro, it's yeah, over. I'm, yeah, no, it's, it's not. Okay, I I could drop some gay guys, but I'm not going to. What's this that got episode. to do with? Because I'm cool with a few of them. But you can't say faggot, bro. Yeah, I didn't say faggot like how you're making it sound. I'm just saying I wasn't gay. You said I'm not a faggot. I don't watch Wakanda. Yeah, or just, Marvel or whatever. Anything with... Yeah. You know how many people fuck with Marvel movies? Okay, and that's good for y'all. I mean, I... Me I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not like a fucking... I can't... Girl I, Wakanda. I probably haven't watched the last three Marvel movies. Is that what out. it is? No, nah, bro, it's... Yeah, you're a Wakanda. Oh, I saw uh, Francis Aganu, uh, <laughs> Kamar Usman, and uh, Israel Adesanya. They did that in, in a picture. So there's three of them, right? They run like a group of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're off Marvel movies. We can't yeah. talk about that. Yeah, I don't, I don't watch stuff like that. I did watch Batman whenever I was a kid. Well, shit, I probably watched it whenever I was like nineteen. My ex, my, my kid's mom uh, liked. You're still Batman. a kid at nineteen. DC, buddy. Yeah. DC. What? Wait, what I don't you know what you're talking what? about, bro. Batman. I never know. I, so listen, bro. This is real shit. I've never figured out the difference in DC and Marvel. I really don't have any idea. Like, which one's Wolverine? Hmm. Marvel. All right, so but Batman's DC, so Spider Man is Marvel. Yeah. But why ain't he ever out kicking it with fucking Iron Man or? He the new ones. Who is? He? I haven't watched none of them. In Who years. is Spider Man? Yeah, Spider Man, bro. See, that, I, I quit watching. I, I, I watched. I did watch Spider Man too. I watched. Uh, I think what they only had like one, right? With Toby. No, nah, that his they name? had a couple other. Toby McGuire. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. <laughs> yeah, Who do you think I was talking about? I thought you was trying to make. Uh, Toby no, I'm being bro. I'm being serious. I didn't. I don't know what a Wakanda is. But he did one, two, and three, I think. Yeah, I don't know. But then they had the mother Spider Man. They did the three Spider Mans. Oh no, there's a three bunch three. of them. But totally oh yeah, I watched one where he uh, kissed uh, kissed the little redheaded bitch. That little bitch. <laughs> yeah, I liked her. That's what, that shit. I'm a redhead too. That shit fucking made me throb in the pants side. It did. I love that bitch. I like redheads. I've actually never been with a redhead, and that's a fact. Never been with one. I've always wanted to try because I know I can fuck. You know what I mean? So I was like, I guarantee if I can fuck like this, all redheads can fuck like this. Because I like my ass. I've heard them redhead. redhead girls, bro. Yeah, I, bro. I saw. I'll be watching porn with redheaded girls, and them bitches they get down, me, bro. bro. They eat ass. Like they're like all the way down their throat, tank licking. I can't. I That's can't, freaky. I can't really watch the the redhead porns because redheads are so pale. Mm. Mm. You're not really a pale redhead though. Mm -mm. Like, but I mean, you got a lot of tats. So I don't know. Maybe that shit's just soaking in, giving you some pigment, some yeah. melanin. Yeah, I don't know. Like but, up here, I'm real pale. Well, yeah, but I uh, too. But like, my arms are just like real freck freckly. So, but what I'm saying is, is that them fucking around, so. them redheads. You don't like bitches, them white. Them the, white. You know bitches. them redhead bitches that got that. Like, you don't like white people. I mean, whoa. Yeah, you know I mean, hell. Yeah, I mean, in a podcast, cut her, I, cut her off. Cut that out. We gotta cut that one. Hey, you can't right. say you don't like white people. I, I said red. I, I didn't say I didn't. You don't like. like you don't like redheads because a redhead. They're so pale. No, buddy, it's you like, want to know why, buddy? Because whenever you're a redhead, like it's stale. a birth defect. That's a birth defect after generations. That's a fact too. Look that up, fat ass. So what you're saying? <laughs> so what you're saying is you don't you don't like retards. That's what you're saying. I never said nothing. So like you don't like people that redheads? have any type of problem. So if you got a problem, he don't fuck with you. I do. I support you. I'm one of y'all. You I'm one of y'all. You just used the F word against the gays, bro. Oh, so now, now, okay. Boy, I actually, out. no. I can't even say He that. called him the gays. He put him in a category. The gays. <laughs> yeah, I did put him in a category, bro. <laughs> he was boxing himself in. <laughs> yeah. Wait, will you yeah. do me a favor, bro, and hand me one of them? Because I, I am thirsty. But, uh, yo, God damn, you already drunk both of yours? Did you already drink? How many did you drink? Come on. I drank four. Well, the other two was the big boys. 
I appreciate you, bro. Now, I gotta take this shit's this. gross. This is um, look. This is the diet beer. That's what they call this little bullshit. It is. It's fucking two point <clears throat> six carbs because I'm. Trying to lose you know weight. I mean, <clears throat> someone's. I'm taking. Look, bro, I'm taking the take. take yeah. Anyways, food. though, I'm not that type of guy. I don't care about uh, the carbs and calories, as you can tell. I'm a, a real outgoing. I haven't for a long time. I'm either. outgoing, eating anything I want to eat type of type of gal. So, um, this bullshit though, I'll tell you what. This are you picking your nose? Okay, don't do that. Especially where. I, okay, okay. I thought you was in there. I thought you were throwing boogers. So, yeah, don't do that one. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to tell you a story. No, hold on. I'm telling people that Miller Lite, I will support Miller Lite. You don't have to sponsor me. But if Miller you want Lite. to, I'm saying this is not Miller Lite. That's why this is on here because it's not Miller Lite. If this was Miller Lite, wouldn't have tape on it. Me, me personally, I would never go to a beer and say, hey, give me dot to a store. My fault. I would never go to a store and say, hey, give me a diet beer. Because me, personally, I'm not a... Fuck boy, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. Uh, you know, so you gonna do that every like that's, you gonna make that thing? What you gonna piss off the gays? No, hell no, I don't want to jump by none of them. I heard a couple of them can fight. Yeah, I know some that can fight. Yeah, well, I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. Oh, bro, we was down in Miami. Uh, shout out to my sister, uh, tell them Elizabeth. Me. You want to fuck with them? Who? Tell them No, hell no. Uh, shout out to my funny. sister Elizabeth and uh, and Trace. Uh, they took me to Miami uh, back in June of last year, and uh, me and my nephew uh, Tyson, we was walking down the strip, you know what I mean, in Miami, and uh, he wanted to go to the twist. Well, and that had a twist, you know what I mean? I was like, oh, that sounds kind of freaky. He just told me it was a bar, <coughs> and he's underage, so at the time he was underage, because 17 at the time. No, he might have been 18. No, he was 17, about to turn 18. Well, anyway, so, cuz, like, let's go over here, blah, blah. And I was like, oh, I don't know. I don't know if this seems like a good idea, you know what I mean? Because it was called The Twist. <laughs> so you right? just knew. I, just, I had a feeling. Mm-hmm. Well, they picked us up. Uh, I was like, nah, we're just going to have uh, Elizabeth and Trace come get us. Boom, boom. They come get us. They pull up. We start going down the street, and we pull up next to The Twist. There's this one guy out there. And you see. Lonely? No, he was standing there. Oh, he was not lonely after this. <laughs> he was standing there. And there was, like, 400 of them gays, dude. And they ran up in a group. And they and they I swear they was tugging him, dude. They pulled him apart. <laughs> tugging him. Yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> dude, like, was, what are you talking like about? there was like three of them on one arm on each side, bro, legs and everything. They pulled this guy apart, dude, and was making out with him. All of them. They all had their tongue down this one guy's mouth. So how I'm, many of them? There was like four hundred. And that's not a that's not a joke. <laughs> so yeah. So we end up we end up stopping. She stopped out front. She tells Trey Sailors, pull over. We're stopped. And I was like, this ain't a good idea because, you mean, I'm sexy as fuck. So I thought at any minute they was going to drag me out they that car. Start pulling your yeah. yeah. They was going to get Suck out there. On you. They was going to pick me up by the ankle and spit in my ass. So I was actually nervous the whole time. And um, what are you looking at? Okay, so I was nervous. Yeah, you had me nervous there. See what I'm saying? I get freaked out real quick because of this, <laughs> because of this story. Because of that. And there was this gay guy walking. Shout out. I really, I, I got some gay friends. You know what I mean? Greg's one. Uh, I do have gay friends. Uh, I really don't hate you guys. Bro, come on. Mike Stevens, yeah, love you. Austin Shepard, love you. I'll start name dropping. Fuck it. Anyways, I do I do got gay friends. Name dropping gays. Yeah. I, That's a weird thing to do. Yeah, but nah, fuck with them. Those are my gay friends, dude, right? You know That's mean? it? Yeah. I mean, how many do you want? I can't have 12 of them. Oh, you have more than two, then you're gay. I got a lot of gay friends. Yeah. You uh you have too many gay you have a lot of gay friends, and I've always I said this. I think he's actually gay. Like, I'll do some gay shit. I'll do some shit make me question my sexuality. But cuz. But but here's the thing. I'm he'll trade. He'll trade. I remember that. He came down to the house. Yeah, he's freaky. He's freaky. I won't do no shit. But anyways, what I was trying to tell you all, oh, you yeah. will do gay shit. But what I was saying, what I was saying though is, as we was sitting there in the car, there was this this couple gay guys, and they wasn't like normal gay guys. You know what I mean? Like dog, they was like dressed to the, like they was dressed like women. Dressed to the nine. Yeah, oh, they, they was, was drag. Yeah, they was. Yeah, oh. it was all of them was like that. They was oh. freaky as fuck. So you right? didn't give us the whole story. I didn't know what was going. But on. But I don't know what they're called. I just knew that it was them. So <laughs> it was them. Yeah, I, they, them they. Yeah, them they. It was them they. <laughs> so anyways, though, they started walking. We're in a van, bro, and uh, they're walking, and we're in the van, blah blah. And one of them like is about to walk past like a sign or something, and looked at Tyson, bro, leaned back and hit him with one of these. And Tyson, seventeen year old ass. Hitting back with one, oh. they was do, they was doing the spirit finger wave, okay. and I looked at him. I said, "Bro, you can't do that. They'll grab your little sexy ass up, boy. They will take you in there. They will fucking fuck you in the stall." <laughs> you know what I mean? He's like, "I don't think gays also rape." I watched them. They literally jumped, bro. <laughs> I was I about got out and started swinging for this guy. 
I'm not. They jumped this man. They were. They literally. They had 46 on one man. One fucking individual, dude. And it was a little guy. It wasn't like it was a big guy. It didn't take that many people to get him. <laughs> to get him. Yeah, that's what they got. Uh, bro, this is a true fucking fact, bro. They suck like 20 of them on him. They, they was like, get him. And they all, they jade him out right there in the middle of the street and was kissing him the whole time it was happening. So they was beating him up and kissing him. I don't know if they was actually beating him up. I was, I don't know, bro. It was, <laughs> Why? I didn't want to sit there and watch. I thought, I thought a murder was happening. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bro. She stopped. She turned around, hit the hit the circle, bro. Pulled up out front of it. Listen, we like I said, we I just was on the side. Put in this claim route. All my gay friends, I fuck with y'all. Yeah, I, I like gay guys too. I guess. Wait, I got gay girlfriends too. Yeah, I don't. I don't really like lesbians because I mean they're not benefiting me none. So yeah, and fuck y'all. I can see how you feel that. Way. Fuck the gay girls. I don't be wanting to fuck people though. Yeah, so. me neither. I mean, me neither. You don't now so that you're in a relationship. Yeah, now that I'm in a relationship, I don't. But even when I'm single, I don't be fucking <laughs> people. So. But yeah, uh, so yeah, I mean the gays though, yeah they're pretty freaky, especially down in Miami. I don't, which I guess they was having like a gay parade down there around the time too or something. Like I guess they was like walking naked and shit. I don't oh. even know if you're allowed doing that, but they I guess nah, they was. I think some states, bro, like will let them or something. Motherfuckers is just like cops. Well, is, cops is worried about in the big cities like that. There's so much other crime going on. They're yeah, like, well that's what I'm saying. Like they, I think they was like, I think that. The gay community will get together and they'll like fuck some shit up, dude. Like, oh, absolutely. They'll like start burning buildings down and shit. You know what I mean? Like the George Floyd shit or whatever his name was. <laughs> that wasn't like, gays, but that's what I'm saying. They'll do that type of shit though. Like they'll like riot, right? You know, gays. I don't do know that? if gays riot, bro. I, I know they. Well, they. I know they're, they. They protest. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And they wear. You know what I mean? I had a gay guy once mad that I don't want to fuck him. Talk about that. Yeah, yeah. You want me to tell that story? I want to hear that story. I actually cannot. I cannot tell that story. You can't? Yeah. I cannot tell the story. You can leave him. You ain't got to tell who he was. Yeah, I'm not going to tell the story right now. Maybe one day. Uh, I've actually had a few gay guys. To be honest, there's a lot of gay guys around. Uh, (laughs) Undercover. Undercover. They're actually freaky. I don't think. Is he allowed talking? Like, is he allowed in talking? Was that in the job description? Should I I get up and hit him with a bottle? He's here. Okay, yeah, if I guess. I, one of these days, I'll talk about all the gay guys that try to suck me off. Yeah, uh, one day. Once we I'll know, name them. Once we, if you guys, if we get enough they views. They can't even be mad. Once we get enough views and you guys get us out of here, uh, why don't you run up run up and uh, like turn that off? The heat? Is that heat or air? That's well, the I don't heat. Know, just, That's the heat. Oh, shit. It went off. Right? It went off. You're cool. Hey, don't worry. Yeah, we can cut that right out. Yeah. As soon as it came on, you said something. But yeah, one of these days, I'll tell you all, this, all the names of the gay yeah. dudes that try to suck me down. Yeah. So get us... Like and comment, bro. Get us famous. Share this what? shit. If you guys get us famous, wow, everybody, wow, everybody. <laughs> just, that's that's the that's the uh, the appeal of them supporting us. Is yeah, we'll, we'll talk. We'll talk. We'll talk. It. I'll talk. I'll tell y'all some we'll, fucking we'll, stories. We'll tell dude. y'all all the. I'll tell y'all about my mom and dad's friends who used to come up there and molest me. Oh my god, bro. No, they didn't. They well, I don't, wouldn't call it molest. It was like no guys, no guys did that to me. Women did for sure. That did happen. Out them, huh? Out them, bro. They'll get fucking canceled, and they ain't even got a platform yeah. to get canceled. Oh no, they're all yeah, they're all drug addicts and stuff. So yeah, that's right. That's what I'm saying. They can't even be canceled. Yeah. So we get out them people without any repercussions for yeah, them. Yeah, go hit that. That shit's back on already. The heat. It's not even cold. And you could probably hear it on this mic. This oh mic, yeah. This mic's a bad motherfucker. I paid a lot of dollars for this. <clears throat> what are we gonna talk about next? I'm I think it's flowing pretty good, to be honest with you. Yeah. Like, we're just talking shit. And it's going to be, I, I feel like it's been relatively funny. Mm-hmm. But we we got to, we can't just stay on the gays now. We got to yeah. get past I'm get the off gays. The gays yeah. Get off the gays, Ricky. Or get on the gays. Get on the side. I wonder if they could jump me in. <laughs> jump you in like gays yeah. a gang? <laughs> yeah, ain't it? It kind of is, right? I mean, it kind of is. You know what I mean? They yeah, support. I think the gays get down like that. They They probably jumped a few people. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. I'm sure there's been some gays. And it's like, yeah. I think the gays. Let's are, get him. The gays are probably worse than the cops, I would say. In my eyes. Uh, I've never had cops try to fuck me. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, you ain't lying, but. You know, the, the, the gays at least ask first. The cops just be doing shit because they can. Are we going to talk about the cops? Should we talk? I think Portsmouth cops are, are pretty cool for real. Yeah. I've seen. A lot of Portsmouth I'll cops. I work with a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta <Yeah>. go. <laughs> I'll work with a few. Did you turn that little shit off? You can't turn the fan off. They don't just have an off switch? Uh, no, nah, their shit's all like up 
the what's them? Door. What's them things right there? I know this. That's just opening the doors. Yeah. We had to blow the pilot light out. <laughs> <laughs> and that was like on an episode of. So it's not on constant. I mean, I, it might not be that noticeable. And even if it is, guys, if you got a problem with that little noise you hear in the background, like, you know what I mean? Shit's ghetto. Shit's ghetto. But it's not going to be ghetto forever. Yeah. You know what I mean? We just rented this beautiful space that you guys wouldn't even believe what's, what's on the other side of the Oh, camera. yeah. You I wouldn't. mean, this fucking place is miraculous. We, uh, yeah, dude, this is a mansion, actually. We rented out a mansion just for this podcast. Just for the pod, you know what I mean? <laughs> Thousand bucks a night. Yep. So, uh, and if you got my location, you ever try to come find me, bitch, I will kill you, huh? I, bro, what if somebody? How much us, beer you got in your shit, bro? This is my. God damn! Fifth. Hold on, I gotta chug this little shit. Yeah, this is my fifth beer. Um, somebody gonna get us swatted, bro? Cause that'd be kind of dope. Cause as soon as I chug that bust, too, bust through, and I'll tell you I'm what, be like, pop, pop, and we're gonna get killed. Man, this beer sucks. It's just a pilsner, bro. It's just the same as Miller Lite. No, cause this is terrible. This beer is so bad. I want to cry. It's low carb, bro. You yeah. ain't you ain't gained no weight drinking that beer. Well, you think I gained a lot of weight? Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> That's right. Is that what you're trying is, to say? I'm sensitive. So to I'm gonna tell you what. The fats are more sensitive than anything I've ever met. That's true. That's so, true, bro. But once people get fat, bro. So you want to fat shame? I'm gonna get fat shamed, and I ain't did nothing but. Tell everybody they're beautiful and you been black shaming. <laughs> no, no, you no. Been gay shaming. No, when? You, been lesbi- you said you hate lesbians. I, I think. Did I say that? I think so. I don't know. See, but I've been drinking. That's why I don't like to drink. You hear me? I'm one beer in. I know. And after I drink too many beers, I just don't. Too know. many, bro. Once you drink a half a beer, I'm done. You're wild. I probably need to go home for real. We gotta drive out of here. <sighs> oh fuck! What time is it, bro? I didn't even get to take my chlamydia medicine today. <laughs> and that shit, I'm gonna tell you, that shit hurts. Uh, I hope we don't fuck around and get swatted for real. I mean, but if you know how to swap people. <coughs> yeah, if you know how to swap people, that shit would be actually funny, but as long as it wasn't at our house, because, like. I mean, yeah, if it's like this mansion that we rented out. Yeah, get us swatted here. I think, I'm not going to tell you where we're at, but the person that owns this house, this mansion, <laughs> they've been swatted. They've been swatted for sure. Oh, that's and we can't that. even talk about it because they got an open court case. That's the still open case. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's still an open oh, yeah. case. They, so we can't even talk about it, but they've been swatted. They've been swatted. Swatted down. Swatted down. Spent, hey, first day out, T Grizzly type shit. <laughs> they couldn't even play that for me because I didn't spend that long. She was in there forever. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, you said she. She. They. I, I, I didn't want to put a, I didn't want to put a, the real label on the person because then, you know what I mean? Because then all of a sudden, I'm assuming it's a, it's a man. You know what I mean? So oh, I said so. she. It's a boy, I think. I think it's a they. It's a they, them. They them how? Because I'm wondering how the fuck does this work? Sometimes I look at the <coughs> them and I wonder if they are they. Yeah. Uh, but anyways, though, yeah, so we're just having a good time just talking shit. But yeah, we put this beautiful podcast together, the uh, beautiful little set. We got us right here. That's him on the right side and me on the left side. Obviously, if you can't tell. If I'm you a light, can't tell. I'm a light skin compared to this guy. Uh, and he's not <laughs> even dark, so yeah, I don't know how it works. You can't tell. But yeah, you can see on there that I got my Harley Davidson face tat with my nose ring. I ride Harleys. He rides I don't other have men. No face tats or nose rings. He don't even have a he don't even have a and tattoo. I, I really I fuck with I fuck with A Ron. Yeah, hey, shout out to but my dude A Ron. He made this. Think, only paid fifty bucks for it. I don't think he made my beard look full like like Yeah, no, it right. looks like But I mean I fuck with this. Like I fuck I love yes. this. You know what I mean? I love it. Your beard yeah. on there looks like Mufasa's off Lion Kings. Literally. Yeah. You're right. Well see, A Ron's racist, not me. He thinks. Hey, shout all, out to all, Aaron because I won a raffle. I ain't gonna say what the raffle. Was yeah, before. he won a raffle today, Aaron. Uh, actually, fuck you for that because he hit me up. He messaged me and said, "Hey, do you want in on this raffle?" And I said, "No, buddy. I gotta fix my car tomorrow." Because I didn't. You so mean I don't expect to win hours? nothing? It don't matter. But you gotta live off your girl. I gotta live off my girl. So you can't be. Like I'm broke. Babe, my girl, her tax money. Yeah. I try to flip it. Yeah. I fucked it all up. You know what I mean? I'm still uh, living off a stimulus check from two years ago. Yeah. But you got so many kids, bro. You fucking balling off that little shit. And you got the PPP <laughs> loan. <laughs> I never got it. <laughs> but I wish I would have. Yeah, me too. Because uh, I don't think they're even hitting people back for those. Are they? No, nah, motherfuckers. That's Are they a, going down for that shit? You know what? Because I'm really mad I didn't go for one. And they're not going and down. I could have because I had a business at the time. Yeah, I did too. I had a food truck. I started a fucking food truck. I went to uh but went to I jail. was worried. Yeah, I went to jail up in New York and started a food truck. I had a, I had a uh, food truck in New York, and I was like, man, this is banging. So I was like, you know what? They wanted me to get a job, so I was like, I'm going to start a food truck, bitch. Because they didn't want me. I'm not going to go work at McDonald's. What the fuck? I look like flipping a fucking patty, mm-hmm. bitch. Wait, can so, I get another one? 
Uh, God damn, he's right. Bro, I drink like this every day of my life. Yeah, but you probably shouldn't not on here. Well, I'm, 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 I'm fucked no up. How many's left? I'm no so give me one. I'm I'm trashed. I ain't gonna lie. I'm no different. I might not be able to drive home. Um, so we anyway, should do like heroin or something crazy on here. I don't know about that. Yeah. Each week just do yeah. Drugs. Each week we just do different drugs, dude. All the Thank all you, the uh, heroin around here has fentanyl in it. So yeah. Well, that's why you got to get that uh, that good, that good shit. You know what I mean? Well, I, I'm pretty sure uh, I think fentanyl. The good shit's the shit that has fentanyl. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think fentanyl is actually good for you though, because I don't. It actually, I think it weeds out like the weak. The motherfuckers that die off of it obviously can't handle shit. So that's a fucked up thing to say. We're cutting that out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, I'm just joking. That was a joke. LOL. We're cutting that out. No, we're not gonna cut that out. Yeah, we have we'll, to we'll, cut we'll, we'll, <laughs> see, he's worried about what people think. I'm not. Uh, you can actually sue me if you want, because like, what's gonna happen? What are you gonna get? My girl's tax money, bitch. You ain't getting shit from me. Um, but yeah, I wish I would have got a PPP loan. What are we what doing? I, I just, I, I'm using, I'm, I'm recycling tape. All right, well, will you get that off there? Because it's on there, tight. <laughs> Are you kidding me? No, I'm serious, bro. I got, I don't even have a callus on these little fucking. I don't have no calluses either. I'm a gamer, dude. I don't own a store like you, buddy. I'm not up there fucking selling drugs and selling boxes, dog. You sell some boxes. I sell obviously. fucking. You're a suboxone dealer. How about that? Catching. <laughs> <laughs> We're cutting that out. <laughs> but no, I sell the the Delta Eights or Delta Nines or whatever they are. Yeah, well, I don't know what that is. Legal so. vapes that every fucking carry out in town sells. Do you so, sell those? Yeah. The guy, At we, your we store? Have, yeah, we have the Delta Delta Eight. He has eight. a store, the Real Ben's Deal store. Oh God, he just fucking butchered the name of my store. Is that not the name of it? It's the Real Deal Ben store. The Real Deal Deal store. We're not Real Ben. What is it? But we're not the Real Deal Ben. The real. The deal. real. The Real Deal You're Ben drunk. store. I'm. T- I told y'all, I was saying, <laughs> bro. I drank a whole beer, bro, and I chugged it. I'm not playing. When you're going to drive me home, uh, no, but that's the real, the Real Deal Ben store. That's what I said. I'm pretty sure. Each time, but we don't have a Ben store no more. Okay, so what's it called now? You're changing the name of it now. Now it's the Pallet House, baby. It's the Real Deal Pallet House. The Real baby. Deal Pallet House. Y'all heard it. Y'all heard it here first. Come here and buy pallets. And I don't even. They don't even have pallets there. Is the weird thing that you're going to sell pallets and there's not even pallets there for you to buy. It's pallets of merchandise. It's but where are they at though? Because I walked in there today, I didn't see one. You didn't go in there today. I was in there. Then you saw them. No, where was that? Your store is a piece of shit. <laughs> So you want to get over here and plug my shit. <laughs> yeah. And then be no, like, I forgot. I, I forgot, like, bro. You, 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 there's a lot of pallets that you would walk in and be like, oh, <laughs> fuck. There's so many. I don't even know which one to choose from. So you get lost and walk back out to your car and leave with nothing. That's that's probably what happened a lot. Yeah. No, uh, really, though, I'm just joking. I didn't go there today. But no, no I, you didn't. Yeah, but he does have a, his own store. This, Like I said, this is my brother. So check out his store. I got a couple businesses, baby. Couple you businesses. You see a vending machine in town, just buy something. Yeah, vending machines too. He had a vending machine at uh, Glockner's that didn't have nothing in it for three months. So, <laughs> Listen, bro, if well, you I'm actually own a store, shit. don't hit him up for uh, shit because he's not going to refill it. I mean, and yeah. also, a couple of his shit, you don't even get your change back. You put in a ten, bro. You don't get no change back. Bro, don't put no ten in my yeah. shit. Hey. That's a single, bro. Because bro. you ain't gonna get no change back. That's sickening, bro. You know what I mean? <laughs> like you go there for a fucking candy bar, bro, and you just got charged ten bucks for a fucking for a Kit Kat, and that's for you can't do that to me, bro. You got to keep the coin mech filled, and I don't always keep it filled. So, yeah. you know what I mean? I was just joking. I didn't know he was really ripping people off. Uh, God damn, that's dude. Just, that's just the ones I got at the old folks' homes. That's fucked up. That's fucked up to do at the old folks. But they do get checks and shit. And that's what I'm saying. Yeah, bro. so like fuck I'm, them. I'm paying them checks. Yeah. Oh, so you actually you have incomes. Oh, y'all got incomes. Yeah, I don't. I don't have incomes. Uh, yeah. I'm actually. This is. I'm banking off this. If this don't this work, this is it for him. Yeah. <laughs> if y'all don't make this happen for him, he's got to start. I'm gonna go. He's gonna have to keep living off his girl. Go sell my ass. Yeah, my girl does have a job. She works at a rehab. I don't know how that happens when she's a junkie. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. My, my old lady actually, she uh, <coughs> never did a drug like me. I've never did drugs in my life. I was smoked weed like 20 times. But uh, my old lady's like that too. She's old as fuck. She's ancient, man. <clears throat> yeah, my old lady's old. She's like, she's 10 years older than me. So whenever she gets mad at the kids and shit, she'll be like, go to bed. And I'll be like, fuck, I get to walk with them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, for real, because she's old and like, she's mean, dude. She, you know her. She's always yelling. Uh, the older you get, bro, the grumpier you get. I, I'm grumpy. I'm old. I'm grumpy. Yeah. But I've well, noticed, I, I've I noticed that she's grumpier than I am. And she yells like a black lady, too. Yeah. She, uh, she, yeah. I, which I, that's why I dated growing up. Was, uh, was She's was, ethnic, for yeah. sure. I, I used to date. But she's uh, kind of Asian looking. Yeah. She, she's she looks Asian, but she acts yeah, like Eskimo. a grumpy black, like my mom. 
Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Vita, love you. Vita, my love mom's you. my mom's grumpy. Yeah, she uh, is. And she's, she's black. never been mean to me. And she's black as a fuck. Vita's black. I'm gonna talk about a story one of these days on this pod about being a mixed kid with a black mom, with a black mom and not a white mom, because most mixed kids have, have white, white moms, moms. Yeah. and most people. In general, blacks and whites. They like to see the outlook of that little shit, right? Well, they assume that all mixed kids have white moms and they were raised by white women. Mm -hmm. But I wasn't. I was raised by a black woman. And that changes my dynamic. But I'm going to talk about that some other time. Yeah. I, yeah. But anyways, my point, I don't know what he was getting at, but I have dated. I'm serious about some shit. Like, that's that's a real thing that I think it made a difference. So you love black women? I love all women. You just don't sleep with them. You've never been with a black girl, right? I've got a black baby mom. Do you? Oh, fuck yeah, you do. Yeah, <laughs> fuck. He's been there. with one black girl. I uh, I remember when I was a kid, We didn't. I lived in Wayne Hill, so we didn't have really, really many blacks. It was all down the village. <laughs> he said blacks. We didn't. The way you said black sounded a little bit racist to me, though, for real. Did it? It did. Yeah, well, see, you know, this every is... white person, when they say black, like somebody could be talking about a black phone yeah. or a black. And they say, they... But the way they say black, yeah. I'll be like, I'll be well, I could say, like, yeah, I could say blacks like the way I read it on like markers. You want me to say that? Just make it a you know how thing. you know white how people say black. That's a joke. Say the word black. Okay, so anyway, an anyways, aggressive. I was just about to talk about how many fucking black vaginas I've pounded. That was aggressive. Uh, yes, yeah, so I used to sleep with nothing but black girls, and uh, Ooh, you I realized black kid one time. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna. Oh my god! <laughs> you got a black kid with a white girl. <laughs> yeah, that did, that happened. That happened. That that. that but the Damn. black kid came out had Bro, Mongolian had a spot. Mongolian spot. Yeah, that is crazy. You was up that. there in the I'm, fucking <laughs> waiting room hey, at the hospital. Yeah, hey, I, I was see my baby, and the nurse was like, hey, "This ain't your baby, bro." Yeah. Well, they let me hold it. They let me hold the little motherfucker. <laughs> And it's a, yeah, I was like, who's goddamn black baby is this? Yeah, ain't no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is crazy. You brought that up, dude. That's crazy. I think God, about that, it a lot. Do you? Yeah. Well, I, I quit because that shit hurt, dude. You know what I mean? <laughs> I know it I did. sold my car for that little fucking baby. It was, uh, you was young, too. Oh, yeah, I was young as fuck. Because that's back when we was kicking it every day. I was 16. And you came over and you was like, bro, I went to the hospital to see my baby. Black. And the nurse said, this baby has Mongolia spots. There's yeah. no way it's yours. Yeah, hell yeah. And you was true. like, oh, shit, and just left. Hell yeah, I left. What was I going to do? Sit there I mean, hold the little baby? Support it. <laughs> support, support his head. Yeah, and fuck that kid, bro. I think I dropped it and everything, bro. Just dropped it off. No, uh, really, uh, but yeah, I was going to have another black baby. That one was for sure mine. But uh, we're not going to talk about that. Yeah, uh, that baby is yours. I've just seen it. How many black babies I got? God damn! I was, I was talking about a different one. Oh, you talking about the black white baby? It's white. Yeah, but it's your baby. Yeah, I don't know about all that. I, uh, <coughs> Anyways, though, I just seen it two weeks ago. You saw him in person? I didn't know if it was a boy or a girl, but I seen it. I said, "Oh, that's Ricky, baby." Oh yeah, that sucks. Oh, which one you, you bro? Which one? I don't know which one he's talking that's about. True. That's true. I, I've slept with a lot of black women. I did sleep with one black girl and had a well, one white girl and had a black kid with it. That was crazy. <laughs> And that's, bro, but anyways, though, what I was saying, though, is, yeah, uh, I just, I used to have a thing for black women. They was, they was always real fun. They was, like, real unique. Is that the word for it? Unique? They was real uh, unique. We would call them, uh, We didn't really see them. Exotic. Yeah, they was real exotic. We didn't have them up in Wayne Hills, so whenever you would see so one, you, you saw yeah, you wanted to jump on it. Yeah. yeah it was I, like, I feel it, I it feel was it. like. That's how white girls treat me. I feel like that's how Adam and Eve was with the apple. You hear me? Is that what it was? They, they ate apple or something? Yeah, mm-hmm. that's what it was. Black girls, I just ate them up. I'd fucking wrap that fucking blurple fucking puss all around my face, dude. And I'd just chew on that motherfucker. I didn't really not eat vagina back in the day, so I used to chew on the lips. I went to a, a school, and it was You all, went to an all-white school, right? It, I didn't go to all-white school, but You went was, to Slow Tech. I went to Votech. Yeah. And I was the only, like, there was, you could go there from any area. Like, all the kids from Portsmouth, which were a lot of black kids, could have went there. Mm-hmm. But they didn't. Mm-hmm. But I fucking made the, the mistake of going. Well, you was trying to be a, become a cop, right? You wanted to be a cop. No, I went there to take dental assisting. No, you didn't. You was there for law I, enforcement. I, I, well, I did, actually, I went there. I didn't know what I wanted to take. I just so we're going to lie. So we're going to lie. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell on you this story. podcast. Let you, me tell you, you the story. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. So I went there because I wanted to leave Portsmouth because I was like, I'm not having fun here. Mm-hmm. And um, I wanted to leave Portsmouth schools, I mean. And I went there and I was the only black dude that went there. The only black, uh, aside from Didi, which is my baby's mom. Um, so... I went there. It's the only black kid. All these other kids come from all these racist towns. You know, I ain't got to name all the racist towns around here. Yeah. They just are. And uh, what I realized while I was there, though, was just like you just said. It's exotic. 
Mm-hmm. I was exotic to them white girls. Oh. They've been living in Memphis their whole life. Ain't never seen one of me. And then bitches. But you wasn't me. fucking none of them. Maybe you maybe you've been with now. You've been with like seven girls. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, you're forty. With seven, you've been with seven girls. I'm not forty. Oh, uh, you're like two years off. You're I'm, forty. You rounded up. I'm like forty. Thirty-five. But anyway, that uh, hurt him. That hurt him. He didn't want to talk about that. Ooh. I told For y'all to know, I wasn't picking my nose. I was scratching right here. I tell baby. everybody I'm old, bro. I love being old. No, you don't. No, I swear to God, shit. I swear I love being. What do you love, love about being old? I love being in my thirties, bro. I'm so. I just. I, don't <coughs> know, I feel like it just feels I've better. Done so much. I, in feel, my life. I feel better than I felt in my twenties. There's no way. I promise you, dude. You're a full blown alcoholic, dog. You got to wake <laughs> up and drink a fucking beer to even get motivated. I don't even drink until fucking. You don't even eat food. I've never saw you eat a fucking meal. I don't eat. Food. We went. Listen, bro. We went to uh, KFC the other day. I don't even remember what we was doing. I think we was coming here. We was coming here. He's coming here to fix it up. Went to KFC and he said, "Just let me get pickles. <laughs> just pickles." Nah, I just really don't eat. Um, That's because you're an alcoholic, buddy. Yeah, you're right. But I'm not an alcoholic that wakes up in the morning and drinks. Mm. But anyway, my whole point was... His eyes are yellow. I'll he has it. hepatitis. And that's a fact, Jack. Show him. Walk up to the camera right now. Show him your eyes. Yeah, the, They're brown and yellow. We'll have to figure out if Duddy can zoom in on that. Um, oh, boy. I just... I don't have hepatitis, though. My nose is itchy. I might have... What do you get with alcohol? Psoriasis? 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 Or? What the fuck? Psoriasis. I think that's what it's called. No, Scoliosis. buddy. Scoliosis. Psoriasis. Yeah, Scoliosis. Ain't that a skin disease? Psoriasis and that shit. Wayne, look it up. <laughs> pull it up on the TV that we ain't used at all. Oh yeah. We got Peacock. Wayne, pull it up. God damn. I'm sorry for yelling, buddy. It, it echoes in here when you yell. Call jaundice. Jaundice, bro. That's what makes you yell and shit. Your liver failure. Yeah, he said. He's. What'd you say? I swear to God, it's like a skin rash. disease. Yeah. No, it's not. Bro. Yes, it is, dumbass. You dumb fat fuck. You fat fucker. It is. <laughs> They're calling me fat, bro. I'm trying to deal with my weight right now. I can tell with these shitty ass beers. Do you want that one? Because it's bad. You don't drink out of it. I know you got fucking for real hepatitis. <laughs> I know you got fucking full blown AIDS. All right, yeah. Magic Mike. Okay, that's what we're doing. So I can dance. I can hey, dance. Wait, who are uh, trying to just. Awesome. I meant to call you Magic Johnson. I called you Magic Mike. Yeah, I was wondering. I didn't, I didn't know what stripping. <laughs> Never mind, bro. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah. He's coming um, off. You actually can't. Give me your beer. For real. You take mine. Mm. I still got to drive out of here. Head away back down to me town. Me too. And I got a flat tire. <laughs> Do you have a flat tire? Mm-hmm. You just rode, rode up here? Like, fuck it. Shit got to be I done. I put it on the buffer like 25 seconds. All right. Yeah, it's flat, though. <laughs> My car, I got to get a transmission put in it tomorrow. Where are you having it done at? Uh, are you having some I'm not going to plug it? them. No, fuck none of crackheads. Doing it. Uh, it's, I'm going to that place uh, up there in New Boston. You know what I'm talking about? Is it New Boston? Nah, Sodaville. By the Sodaville exit. Uh, I'm not going to plug them, bro. Oh, I'm yeah, fuck them. Give us $75, we'll plug you. Yeah, I'm not plugging them. I'll, I'll plug anybody for $75. You know what I mean? Yeah, you you. Cause cause I'm living off my girl, too. I want 10 grand. 10 grand, I'll... Anything, anything around here. Actually, grand. we're cutting out Aaron's logos too. Fuck him. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Fuck Aaron. Yeah, fuck everybody, dude. <laughs> and also, we was talking about it one day. We said, what if we actually do something cool and we start making money off this? You know what I said? He said, what are we going to do to help out the homeless population? I said, I'm buying houses and tearing them down, <laughs> taking people out. Oh. Fuck them. I want everybody around this bitch to be homeless, dude. I hate everybody around here, bro. I see people in the in the, in the the stores, bro, and I take shit out of their carts. <laughs> I do. Um, go past the cart and go cart snatching. How many minutes we on, Kyle? What are we on, Wayne? They don't show you? Well, you ain't going to check. check. Fine, buddy, it's nine minutes. Watch the camera. Look at the camera. They don't show you? It should. That shit always should show us. Yeah, he's a dumbass, dude. I don't even want to be mean about it. Yeah, whisper. I'm like, we'll pick it up. Yeah, watch <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> that motherfucker cost me a lot of... A lot of my girls' paychecks. Fifth Street beat down, cuz. We'll beat the fuck out of your scrawny little ass. All right, let's God damn. It's an hour? Fuck. All right, we got to wrap this yeah, up. Yeah, we're cutting this. Fuck. I don't um, even remember you talking for an hour. I'm really drunk, for real. God damn. I truly believe you are. Yeah, I'm trash. Um, well, I drank a whole beer. A whole one. <laughs> All right. Wayne. I know, Kelly. All right, y'all. Uh, this was supposed to be just like a little... We, this supposed to be a fucking 10-minute video. Yeah, this is supposed to be a little... We might cut this down to 10 minutes. We don't know what might happen with it. But, uh, yeah. So, we're going to wrap this up. Y'all, enjoy your lives. What is today? Monday. So, enjoy your week. This ain't going to be out till. This ain't going to be out until <laughs> Yeah, I, this ain't coming out right now. So, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. We don't know when this is coming out or if it's even going to come out. 
We're gonna that's, watch it back. That's true. Yeah, we're gonna watch we it. We gotta back. spend fifty one minutes watching this shit back. Yeah. God, that's so um, much. We gotta. Uh, we should figure. We should figure out something to say like at the end of every one. <sighs> All right. Yeah. Like, have a blessed day and stay gay. Like that. Well, that wasn't it. That was not it. That was not. I it. don't know that that was it. All right, well, you said I was at their necks, and I was like, at least I wasn't was trying really to get being neck. Rude to the gays. I feel like no. If I was, fuck them. I know ten of them couldn't whoop me. You'd have to at least have eleven, I maybe know, twelve. I know one. I know one gay. Buddy, She'll thrash you. I'm gonna tell you this. Me and any bitch one on one. I'm being honest. Look, now the women hate the game. Me and bitch, me and any bitch in the world. I don't give a fuck. Me and any bitch one on one hand to hand combat. I'm I'm thumping that bitch every day of the week. Anytime I wake up out of bed, I can bro. I can fall down a set of steps and get up and whoop a bitch. And I know that. I've, I've seen I you do spark, it. Yeah. I would spark kick it three. <laughs> you talking about on Bonzer? Shout out. <laughs> Shout out. Shout out, old girl. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Next time, my clothes will be ready for work. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, really. But uh, I, I She knew I had to go to sleep early for work. Didn't want to do my clothes. This is back when you had your only job you've ever had. Yeah, and I beat the fuck out of that bitch. Like I said. You only had that job for like six, seven days. Six months. Watch your goddamn mouth. <laughs> one-on-one, though. One-on-one. No one tried to jump in on it. You know what I mean? And, and I dog walked that bitch, and that's a fact. I did. I beat that bitch up. I was kneeing her, kicking her, choked her a little bit, pulled out a chunk of her hair and everything, too. I all swore, right. Swell that bitch's eyes shut. All right. All right. I'll, we'll see you guys. That, that, just literally a joke. I didn't beat her up. We'll see you guys at the local Walmart. We got to really cut that out. We gotta leave my. See you guys if, at the local say, Walmart. If I see that, if I see that on the video come out, and people see that, my baby mom sees that, she's like, "There's all the proof we need." <laughs> that's <laughs> true. So you never see your kids again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is cut. Yeah, all we right, gotta go. cut all that. Shit. Cut it, Wayne. Fuck. But maybe that should be the last thing we say. Like, we gotta cut all this shit out.